G'day everyone, and welcome back to another episode. This week I have a piece of hairy oak, which I'm not sure what I'm going to turn out of it. I'm thinking maybe a goblet. Um, yeah, it's uh, only only going to be a small something small, but yeah, I think I'm going to I am going to turn a goblet out of it. So yes, another Australian wood. Glorious Australian wood. I love it. Yeah, stay tuned and we'll see it at the end. I'll see you at the end. There it is. What I've done is I've put a 35mm hole in the end of it so I can get it on my small nose. And that is, oh, I can find the marking. There's one, three, four, three, three quarter. I don't know. Pick it up from somewhere. See the wood nice now. There's that hole. Oh, the hole! Mm. 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 That's alright. We can figure something out. Alright, I'm gonna reposition you guys. And we're going to get back to tuning.
Now we wait. I need a tennis ball. Be back soon. Come here. Bring me the ball. Bring me the ball. Good girl. <laughs> have a ball. <laughs> I have. Ew. Right. Get this. Let me stick it in here. Time to fill some cracks.
just remember this is before sanding. It looks so pretty. So beautiful. No, we wait for it to dry. So here we are at the end, and here is our hairy oak goblet. Has a really, really pretty grain in it. And of course, I filled the voids with. 5 minute epoxy and some blue uh, what do you call it? blue stuff and I haven't actually done anything to the inside it's natural and raw Ooh. reason being I don't know what I want to do with it yet whether I want it just to be shown or whether I actually want to use it as a cup. So there we are. Tune in next week.